Hey, what's up? Uh, Colby Sharp, fifth grade teacher here. Today we're going to be talking about the 2022 chapter book from Alana K. Arnold, Just Harriet. You probably know her from her award-winning chapter books, like A Boy Called Bat, her award-winning middle grade books, her amazing career as a YA author. She tells an amazing story. And this one, please, I don't know, but Walden Pond Press, please tell me it's going to be a series. Please tell me we're going to get more of Harriet. Just Harriet is amazing. It's so good. I love this kid so much. And I loved her from the very, very beginning of the book. I love the opening two pages so hard. In the opening pages, she's just like, listen, I'm Harriet. And I lie sometimes. I have night terrors. And sometimes when I have night terrors, I pee the bed. And like she just lays it out there and that it sets the tone for who this girl is. She is upfront with you. You're gonna get to know her. You're gonna fall in love with her. She is amazing. The book starts with her ending third grade. Her mom is pregnant. Her dad picks her up on the last day of school. And she's like, well, we always go and get ice cream to celebrate the last, or smoothies, the last day of school. And dad's like, oh, I have to go get your mom from the doctor. Mom's having a baby, but it's just, she's lying they don't really do that she just tells these these little lies um they end up getting you know getting the ice cream or smoothie uh and going to see mom mom ends up being put on bed rest and she's got like a couple months left in her pregnancy so they sent harriet to grandma's bed and breakfast for the summer it's on like a small island off the coast of california i live in michigan it reminded me a little bit of mackinac island like a very touristy place a very fun place to visit to vacation uh, so she has to go there she's not super happy she does get to take her cat her grandma has a dog they don't really get along the best but you know it's all good and she is going against her will she's not really thrilled about it and she's the whole book is her spending time with her her grandmother at this bed and breakfast and she gets to meet the guest she finds this key and she thinks it leads to this mystery so she's like becomes obsessed with trying to figure out where this this lock to this key goes and you just can't stop turning pages because you love this girl so much and you just want her to be okay you want her to figure out her mystery you want her to just be happy and everything to be okay with her. And she's so interesting. One of my favorite parts of this book is she tells you about the different types of lies because you know she tells lies and she knows all about these different kinds of lies. And I think that's gonna be so interesting for kids to read and kids to see and kids to learn from. And like this book would make such an amazing like read aloud. I think about like, what if you taught third grade? Like what if you read this book aloud at the end of second grade, at the end of third grade as they're heading into summer? It's just so good. So Jess Harriet, add it to your two-read list. Purchase it from your local independent bookstore or read, check it out, rent it from your library. Check it out from your library. Whatever you do, read this book. Kids are going to love it. I promise. I'm so excited to book talk it to my fifth graders. I think that there's some kids in here who would love this. Those kids who are just starting to read, you know, like longer chapter books on their own are going to love this book. It's phenomenal. Five stars. Highly recommend. My name is Colby Sharp. Thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you have an awesome-tastic day.